Hello, welcome back to Blackjack. I'm Blackjack Gabbiani. It's 6.54 a.m. and we're waiting for the Nintendo Direct Mini. I'm not sure what makes it mini. Apparently it's only 10 minutes long. Uh, and they're going to be talking about stuff we already know about, they said. that It's uh, going to be um, just things that were previously announced. However, that does mean some big titles. My mind goes to Breath of the Wild 2. We know about that, and we haven't heard about it in more than a year. Uh, apparently Shin Megami Tensei 5 was announced a few years ago, and we haven't heard anything about it since. Um, we got Metroid Prime 4, uh, which the only thing we know about is that they restarted the entire production because they didn't like the direction things were going. I'm aware. Okay? I'm aware. Just drop it. <clears throat> Uh, we know about Bayonetta 3, which is another thing that <clears throat> was announced and we haven't heard anything since. Um, no More Heroes 3, again, haven't heard anything since. Uh, Bravely Default 2, which is actually the third game. Um, I also had thought that this was going to be a live stream, but I guess I was just assuming that. Because I'm looking at all my subscriptions right now. <sighs> mm, there's one live stream. It's uh, Outside Extra plays Ghost of Tsushima. And I got a reminder that uh, Death Battle is premiering their new Death Race episode in a few hours. So, oh, pardon that. Oh, heavens to Betsy, I am so, so tired. Um, the lighting in here ain't great, as you can likely tell. I don't actually have this much pizza face, believe it or not. So, uh, yeah, you know, uh, even with already knowing about the games, that's still quite a few games. Um, jeez, I saw someone on Twitter... Uh, making a bunch of, like, listing a bunch of franchises, and then someone else deriding them. It's like Nintendo fans have only themselves to blame. It's like, you know, almost all of those series have a game that was announced in that series, right? And, you know, chances are we're going to get uh, a Doom Eternal port at some point, just like we did for the previous game. Uh, <coughs> so, you know, it's just kind of like this, there's weird negativity going on, and it's like, just freaking correct people, you know? You don't have to call them idiots publicly, especially... There's this whole thing about how dare you get excited for anything, and I don't understand that. It's really, really obnoxious. Uh, especially, you know, we're talking about video games. Literal hype machines. Um, we're probably not going to get anything on, like, future Animal Crossing stuff. If we do, it'll be the announcement of the Dream Suite, which people have suspected for a while. But I think that would be it. Otherwise, I think it'll just be the monthly updates. <coughs> what else? Uh, I know Crown Tundra is coming up for Pokemon, but um, I think all we would get on that is, like, and then this is when it's coming out. And then that's, that'd be, like, it. So, yeah, I think that'd really be it for Pokemon. What the hell? Um, I have my hand over the keyboard looking at, um, What? What the hell? No, stop it. D looking at the, looking at my YouTube, uh, page and 
I hit the D button and everything zoomed in. I don't know what happened. Ah! Uh, you know how I say I have no technical ac um, a aptitude? This is exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, it's 7 o'clock. On Shadow of the Rat, Peaches learns to fetch from a purse. That's adorable. It's a channel all about teaching your pet rat tricks. I've never had... Oh, there we go. Okay. N uploaded nine seconds ago. Okay. Share. Copy. La -ba 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 -ba. Let's go up here. Add source. Web page. All right, let's see. Yeah, okay. Oh. No, stop it. What are you doing? Uh, it's, it's this stupid, it went into mini player. Okay. Okay, doesn't everyone know? Shouldn't it just kind of come with that understanding? I'm turning that down to 14. Hello everyone, welcome to our first Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. Yay! We'll be delivering the latest information about upcoming Nintendo Switch games from our development and publishing partners. Yay! More videos in this series will be released this year, so please stay tuned. Okay, let's get into the headlines. Okay, I'm waiting. Oh really? New content. Use your rhythm skills to overcome the threat I wasn't expecting this. I mean, we knew about this game because it's been out for months. But this isn't what I was expecting when they were saying, Oh, you know what that means? We could get smashed off. Yes! Frickin' love, Impa! With these characters, you can take your musical journey for a new spin. Who the heck is Frederick? 39 songs will be added, including remixed versions of the game's background music. You can change the Family background Jewels. music any time so you can listen to your favorite songs while journeying through Hyrule. Oh my god, were those atomophone choo-choo's? Story content, Symphony of the Mask. Play as the mysterious Skull Kid and venture through a brand new map, complete with new songs and a new story. Plus... He has the power to change abilities based on the masks he dons. Interesting. Wait, Skull Kid in these strange lands. D D you missed someone. You missed someone. Available for purchase later today with the second and third DLC. Brace yourself, game. A season pass containing all three paid DLC packs will also <laughs> launch later today. Will include bonus costumes for Link and Zelda. And for those who never stepped to Hyrule's Beat before, you can get the rhythm going when a version of the game containing all the DLC launches October 25th. Interesting. Freaking love Impa. She Save doesn't get the the, the respect she deserves. Hasn't she been in more games than Ganondorf has? I know she has. She was even kind of in the first one. She was mentioned frequently in the uh, guidebook as the one who gave Link his mission. She doesn't appear in the game, but yeah. Watchdog? No, nah, Watchdog doesn't look like this. Uh, wait, is this anything we actually had heard about? It's infiltrating the battlefield. Lay waste to your opponents with an arsenal of weapons and abilities in this online multiplayer third-person shooter. Clash with other players. Get out of the clothing store, you're ruining the the product. Or rise to the challenge against AI opponents that surely bring the heat. Yeah, okay, I remember hearing about battle, this. Your teammates can revive you, letting you immediately jump back into the fray. Immediately after they the actually do it, because it takes a while. Cross progression are also supported from day one, along with support for motion controlled aiming. Be on the lookout for lots of content, including Disarming skins, Bomb is written as one mode. word. Stay tuned for more information later today about Rogue Company. Interesting. Brawl without limits in WWE 2K Battlegrounds. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, hey. <laughs> Welcome 
I'm sorry, what? This looks so freaking ridiculous. Is this anything we had heard about either? I don't remember hearing anything about this. This next one will be our last announcement. Oh, is, are, are, is it Shin Megami Tensei 5? Oh my god, yes! Unless, the, unless this is Persona 1 and 2. No, that's the demi fiend. Are we wait? Are we actually getting the the original? Nice. A world that loses its power will fade into nothing. Instead, I can invite you to the world that is to come. It's been a while since we last met. From what I understand, you can totally pull a Cyrus and just become God yourself. Demons. This place is crawling with them. You have done very well in keeping yourself alive. The world will fall for its sins. And everyone living will vanish. Will you tell me who you are? Tokyo died. And I was given life. Ooh, okay, it's three. Interesting. Does that mean we're gonna get... Is it five? Is it five? Yeah! <laughs> Yeah, because these, these games don't really go for good versus evil, they go for law versus chaos. I guess the same path I've always chosen. Everything that we saw was going to be released this year. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. Thank you for watching. Please look forward to more Partner Showcase presentations coming this year. Is this seriously the only games that they can show us? That was five games. Two of which were related. Well, that was interesting. It's weird that they showed us Cadence of Hyrule because, you know, they had said this is for games we already knew about. But, and I mean, technically we knew about that because it had already been released. I mean, didn't that come out like last year? Yeah, I know it did. Telling us about DLC is kind of... I feel like that could have been done elsewhere. 
I mean, it's badass that Impa's in it. <laughs> She's one of my most wanted characters for Smash, remember? And also, um... Oh, I was going to show you um, a picture, but I realize I don't have it on here. Uh, my cosplay Impa. Uh, Fat Impa from the Oracle games. <laughs> with the red dress and the, the wimple and the enormous bosom that in the manga she like hugs Link right into and it's like, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. And speaking of a dry wheezing laugh, that WWE game, what in the crap? What in the crap? <laughs> um, I've already forgotten the name of that shooter game. And they said glitch, but then that wasn't the title. Uh, I don't know. It just looked really boring to me. <laughs> I mean, I knew it was one we had seen before. Uh, so we didn't get. Um, okay, okay. We, I did bring up uh, SMT five, but um, I'd actually I'd been wanting to try out Nocturne. Um. And you know I'm just going to just Cyrus the whole thing. You know I will. Like, spoilers in case I do a playthrough video, but I'm just going to just Cyrus the whole thing. And if any of you fuckers don't know what that means, I suggest you go check out my What Diamond and Pearl Means to Me video. <laughs> uh, or just, you know, freaking play Pokemon Diamond and Pearl because you need to anyway. Mm. It means God. Now bow. <laughs> Always gotta have room for a DBZA quote, right? Anyway, um, it's 7.12 a.m. Uh, I'm super tired. I really freaking am. Also, have you heard that I've had the fan on the whole time that I've been recording? Because when I um, when I did test recordings, I couldn't hear it, but I might have just, you know, heard it too much in real life. So anyway, yeah. Um, I am. I am so sleep. <sighs> Yeah, I'm probably going to pick up Nocturne. I've never played a Shin Megami Tensei f game, and I've only played um, Persona 3, as far as that goes. Um, I wonder, um, was it SMT 2 that was released in two parts, or was that Persona 1? It, it, what, the one of the games came out in two different parts, and I wonder if nowadays they'd release it as one. Because <sighs> it was like, you know, early 2000s, late 90s, they had all kinds of graphical limitations and hardware sorts of, you know. I believe I've said multiple times that I'm really tired. So anyway, though, I'm going to be heading out. By which I mean I'm going to be staying right here and turning the lights back off. Until next time, I'm Blackjack Gamiani and I have sleep to get.